What is up, everyone? Tis I, Z Gaming Guy, and welcome to Subnautica Below Zero. I miss this theme. So, I, I, if you follow me on Twitter, you already saw me freaking out about it, but this has finally been released in early access, and I'm gonna have to preface that. Early access, even then, they say there's probably gonna be some bugs and shit, but nothing game breaking as far as they know. Uh, I saw the trailer, and that's about all I've seen of it. I pretty much ignored everything else. So, survival, yes. I want the standard experience. And man, I'm so hyped for this. God, it looks cool. Um, I These these developers, they just know what's up. You know, like, Simonica was just perfect. It was definitely top three of my favorite series on YouTube that I did. Um, with, you know, maybe God of War and Home Sweet Home being up there as well. Uh... I, oh man, I, oh, and Detroit Become Human is also really good. But Subnautica, though, in particular, like, you know, all you guys were like, when's the next episode coming out? My friends would text me, be like, when are you going to record Subnautica again? I'm like, I know, it's really good. I'm getting on it. I'm sorry. So, oh, I can't wait. And developers, if you're watching this this video, because I know you're probably watching a lot of these, uh, if, you, if you put a Z Gaming Eye poster in there, I'll give you my firstborn. Unknown Worlds. Entertainment presents. Are you getting a cool cinematic intro like the? Nope. All right. Uh, off. Bad. Oh yeah. I do that too. To be fair. <laughs> oh my god! I gotta change the sensitivity. Hold on. Okay, this feels more reasonable. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. Okay, Robin Goodall. Goodall? 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 Um, application interview. Interviewer, why have you applied for this role? Everyone's talking about 4546B. Who hasn't applied? Maybe Jeffries. No, Jeffries is signed on last week. Why this assignment? The last time we found sentient alien life was Strader 6. 17 years ago. It's been fun, but frankly, I'm bored and you have telepathic squid. Oh, they're probably talking about the uh, teleporty guys. I can't remember what they're called right now. It'll come to me later. Uh, I should tell you that rumors about spacefaring aliens on the planet are rumors. If that's why you're here, you'll be disappointed. I'm a xenolinguist. Linguist. Spacefaring aliens are, are holy grail. I want it, but I don't expect to get it there. What qualifies you for this position? There are creatures out there you couldn't imagine, let alone understand. Do you know how I talk to them? I think you correlate responses against stimuli and I do what they do. If they bathe in liquid nitrogen and talk with their feet, I put on my coat and I pull a handstand. But this recruitment process, it's most alien of all. So I'm trying to correlate my responses here. I want us to understand each other. Put me on the planet, I'll talk with the fish for you. Thank you, Miss Goodall. Sandra, Sandra! Sandra, we'll show you out. Sandra! Fucking Sandra. So then, are we Robin, or is that just a re uh, irrelevant thing? Did, we, did the first person we have have a name? I know, like, he had a face and everything. Peepers! That might be us. I'm not sure. In the trailer, it was definitely a woman. Kind of a weird-looking... It's like stickers on there. I just... I'm just so intrigued. I can't wait to go outside. But I'm gonna take my time, I'm gonna explore and shit, okay? But I really wanna like, just run over there and look. Remember information leading to activation of alien technologies, okay. I wonder like, so this looks obviously really like, simple. I wonder if it's gonna stay like this, if that's like part of a theme, or if that's just a placeholder kind of thing. Cause again, early access. Like you can't really, um, interact with any of this. Wait, this is the... Oh, are we? We're not underwater, are we? No. Are we supposed to be for that to work? <clears throat> What's over here? Oh, it's someone else's room. Keep calm. Okay. Um... Robin, blah, blah, blah. please rate your operations performance in your own words. We drilled an ice tunnel to, to encourage a flock of penguins to surface near the habitat where we've been recording their behavior and access to frozen fa over facility. 
interpreted the symbols on the alien control panel and hotwired it to accept Altaria frequencies. I think we deserve a C plus. Wow, that's a you're pretty hard on yourself. Please rate your satisfaction with Altera support. I give it a D. It'd be lower, but my sister's carrying the rest of you. Please describe your plan steps for self-improvement. I'm going to bed. Wait, is this so? Oh, so this is us saying to Jeffrey, whoever we mentioned before, how we feel about uh, everything going on. So whose room is this? Jeffrey's? Laboratory. Whoa. Is that a just antenna? Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. One, one thing at a time here. We're getting ahead of ourselves. Yeah, this is pretty empty in here right now. Hopefully uh, they change that. I wonder if they're going to add people like wandering around too, because it's pretty lonely. Granted, the first game kind of was, but we also had peeper buddies. Hey, there's a Leviathan. Sea Emperor, Sea Emperor. Uh, Emperor produces enzyme. Uh, Peeper delivers enzyme to ecosystem. Emperor relies on ecosystem for food chain. There it is. The circle of life. Ooh. Is that untextured or is this supposed to look like that? I think that might be the alien base they're uh, referring to. Whoa. Whoa! Wow! Nito! And there's a. Uh... Station Zero, this is Vespa. Come in. Hi, Sam. We lost contact with Jeffries up at the research site. <gasps> Not okay, Jeffries. I'll check it out. Understood? You know, the formal bit's cute, but we've shared a wound. Would it kill your career to act like we'd met before? Robin, you know these conversations are monitored. We are Robin. I don't care who knows it's cute. I've been here two weeks, we've hardly spoken. Because you went straight to the planet. Find Jeffries, chat later. Yes, Mom. Okay, and Sam's our sister. The one that we say is reliable. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything. Oh, I was like, what am I hearing? I was hoping I could get some of that food or something. Wait, I don't see any, like, food meters or anything. Okay. We have voice log. Oh, just what they just said. Oh, shit, it's prawn suit. I didn't even fucking notice that. I can't get in it. Can I from the back? Probably not, but just going to make sure, because if I'm missing out on a prawn suit, I'm going to be real upset with myself. Yeah, I can't. Ooh, that's some good sounding uh, thunder. Cry thunder. Doo, 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 doo. Ooh, it's the pretty tree. Snowman! Destroy? Well, do I get that stuff if I do it? Oh no, I'm just a terrible person. I'm so sorry. I thought I was going to have to get that. Uh, I'm going to stay away from that for now. I think we need to go this way. Man, we're just in a little surrounded by some hillsides, huh? I wonder if this is going to be a bit more um, guided initially. I'm sure eventually it's going to open up and just do whatever the hell you want. But ugh, this is like, interesting. It's looking at me. I feel like it's going to hypnotize me. I want to poke it. Oh, these are cool. How creepy would that be, though, if you see like the ones in the distance start looking over at something? Like, uh, something's over there. <laughs> I mean, aside from... The penguins, I don't think the trailer showed anything that's on the surface. And the penguins, I doubt, are going to be uh, hostile. Oh, thunder sounds amazing, doesn't it? I need to make sure I pay attention to the time, too. I don't, don't get too absorbed. Ooh. I wonder if I can eventually mine this. Looks cool. All right, here's a alien base site thing. Um, let's, let's check this out real quick. All right, it doesn't look like you can interact with like, anything. There's a... Yeah. Access designed. 
How'd you know my name? I come in peace. Sam, the building just powered up. It spoke to me. Are you safe? It's never done that before. I'm fine. No sign of death rays. <coughs> I've got an electrical storm on the sensors. Whoa. I think it's already here. That cavern isn't stable. I want you to get back to... Sam? Damn it! Sun and ice. Oh, my shadow terrified me. Um, so can they speak English? No, they should all be dead, right? Unless the AI learned English, or is that just us translating because we're sent, um... What's her name? Oh. <laughs> Robin. Is, is that just her translating it for us so that we know what's going on? Um... I just want to move on for now. Hopefully, if you want to read it, you can pause it. But I'm too intrigued with just getting out there and seeing creatures and stuff. So apparently there's about one to two hours of story content. Um, so maybe we'll get... Oh. All right, then. <laughs> maybe we'll get, like, four episodes max out of this. Because I'm not going to drag it on too long. Um, and I'm not sure if I'm going to come back like every time they update or something. I, I mean, ideally, I would have just waited until it fully released, but I can't. I'm too impatient. Oh, wow! Wow! Oh, that was dangerous. Okay, can't go that way. All right. Because this is a bit more of a cinematic intro. Like a longer one. I mean, longer cinematic. Mm. Okay, I was, I was hoping it'd make like a crackly sound. Oh man, what if like as you're underwater and you're trying to like go for air, you come across frozen bits and you can't escape? Oh man, it's gonna suck. But I mean, it'll, it'll be somewhat of a cool gameplay feature, but it'll be so spoopy. I don't know how I feel like I've been spooked like that. This is some thick ass ice, by the way, and clear. Oh, that does not look good. You know, does that? Oh no! I don't know if I. Wouldn't you just like immediately fucking have a bad time if you're in this freezing ass water? All right, where's my breath at? I don't see any. Can we breathe infinitely right now? All right. Well, let me go with it. Your environment is no longer safe. And your PDA has rebooted oh, in emergency mode. Be advised, high wind speeds will cause lethal exposure in four minutes. Oh. And this game follows what they're saying. <laughs> like, when they're giving countdowns for shit, you better listen. Oh my god, can I breathe with this somehow? Oh, I can. Oh, that's interesting. So now you don't have infinite uses. You've got to make use... I mean, I'm assuming they eventually come back. But, like... They're just quick little stops, not like stay there like the other time. All right, let's keep going. New creature I, 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 because it's a big eye. I get it. That's funny. All right, well, hang on to it for now, I guess. so cool. <gasps> Penglings! I must see them. I must pet them. I must smell them. Penglings! Penglings! Let me up! Penglings, please! I just want to look at you. Penglings, please. Please come to me. <laughs> I can't get up there. I just want to touch the penglings. I copy. I'm out in open water. 
Stay where you are. I'm sending a rescue shuttle. No, I'm okay. I just need shelter. Fine, I'm sending a temporary habitat instead. Look up. Thank you, Sam. Call me when you get there. Please don't attack me when I do this. Oh god, I just kidnapped it. Um. Sorry. I thought, I didn't know that's what it meant by pick up. I thought I was just going to be like, hey, little guy. I'm just like, mine. And I just shoved it in my pocket. Okay. You guys are, you guys are pretty cute. You're also kind of terrifying, to be fair. Um, I feel like you can clamp on my head and murder me pretty easily. Okay. Okay. What's the game plan? Does it, oh, we have blueprints. How do we even make anything? Well, she said she's going to send us a temp thing. Hold on. Let me, um, uh, look up. Oh. Did you really? <sighs> okay, not the most convenient location, but thank you. Oh, yeah, we're about to get some deadly winds or something. Uh, da 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 da. Sweet. So we can call. Sam, I'm at the habitat. Okay. Any word on Jeffries? Nothing yet. And the facility? It said my name. I need to know why. I know. Make something to eat, get equipped. I'll have answers by then. Will do. We actually have help this time. Live help. This is amazing. Okay, um... Yeah. We could use that. And... No. Okay, so we definitely need... Wait. Uh, bo -bo. I mean, that wouldn't be bad, but... Tools. We need a scanner for sure. That's, like, super important. The sooner we get that, the better. What's this? Fins? Okay, go a little bit faster. Silicone rubber. Okay. We back in it, boys. Um... That's not how you do things. Consume. We definitely need more food, too. Okay. We got a little base. What is that? Ribbon plant? Can I eat it? <laughs> What's this for? Uh, let's see if we can do something with it real quick. That's storage. Apparently not. At least not right now. I'm just gonna drop these for now. Um. Okay, definitely need you. Come, get over here. Yeah. New creature discovered. Because they give me water. And I'll have you for dinner. New creature discovered. And perhaps I'll even eat you. New creature discovered. New creature discovered. I kind of missed your voice. Kind of. Okay, let's make some agua. Turn all of them into agua. So for the first episode, I'm probably going to leave in basically everything. Because um, I know that's usually what you guys like. But of course, if you change your mind, let me know. I mean, of course, there might be some things I cut out just if it's like super re repetitive. Um, oh, interesting. Okay, like I said, so battery, what do we need to do batteries? Copper and wire or copper and something? Oh, fuck. We need two ribbon plants and copper ore. Well, good thing those are there. Now we just need to find some deposits. Whoa. Wait, did I not? I didn't cook them. In, oh, I, I did, I think, but I didn't eat them. Did I? No. Dummy. What's this? <gasps> Oh, sea glide, my favorite thing. Oh, it's so reliable. Hold on, don't die. Oh, titanium. Oxygen. I know. That's what we needed. Hey, penguins. I'm so glad. I'm so happy. There's like just a little, little group of them right there, just chilling out. They're my buddies. Wait. Fuck. 
I need copper. I'm dumb. I thought I could make it already, and I got happy. How dare I be happy? <laughs> uh, another fragment of something. Crab trap. Okay. This is so cool. I like. I love this. They design things so like perfectly. Oh wait, is there any more splody fish? I hope not. They scare me. Copper. Thank you, game. Wait, what was that? What are you? Well, I'm not going to worry about it right now. What am I hearing? I think it's just music. <laughs> Oxygen. Yeah. Oh, maybe because it's becoming... Wait, what about the, like, deadly winds or something? Maybe it meant, like, in that area? What is that? What was... Oh, there's a lot of land now. Well, at least things you can walk on, not necessarily land, I guess. Um, cook that. I guess we don't really need it right now, but... I can't remember if they go bad or not. Let's make a battery. And let's make a scanner. Hell yeah, brother. Okay. What else? So we want... Um, well, we want a sea glide for sure, but I really want uh, this. Two titanium and fiber mesh. How do I make fiber mesh? Does it say here? Creep vine. Okay. So we need titanium and fiber mesh. Yeah, make sure that's on one. All right, let's check him out real quick. An intelligent and curious creature which hunts and forages below the waterline, but returns to the surface to breathe. Eats small fish, maybe hand-fed, shows taming potential. <gasps> Ooh, Pinnacarid. You're like a weird bird seal. Penguin. Okay. Fuck, where do we begin? I'm so excited! What's this? Nothing. Okay. Oh wait, fuck, where was that, uh, what was a grab trap? Hold on, let's, uh, titanium. I think I needed two. I had a weird noise. I don't know if you heard that, but off in the distance, I hear like a weird screeching noise. I don't know how to explain it. What if this is like a fucking tentacle from like a massive thing? Oxygen. It kind of looks like it. That'd be cool. But at the same time, my base is right here, and it'd probably destroy it. Doesn't it look like it? It'd be massive if that's the case. Please be a titanium. All right, well, I mean, copper's not bad. I'll take copper. Do you, you hear that, right? This screaming? I might need to turn up the volume for you to hear it. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Okay, we can do the grab trap now. Acquired. Acquired. Oh, your mis mispronunciations. I missed them. What I really want is that sea glide fragment. I fucking can't for the life of me remember where it is, though. Oh, right under us. Underneath us is a thing. Titanium! Hey. And boom, truck locker. What do we need that for again? Oh, uh, what's this? Crap trap, obviously. Oh, yeah, we need fiber mesh now to get that tank. So we need to find creep vines. On the search, we will go for the vines of the creep. I think that sea glider was somewhere down here. No, no. Oh, god damn it. I see something over there. I think it's in the graph trap, though. I wonder how that, I wonder if that works in the penguins. I mean, this gives me titanium, so might as well. Oh. See, this is what I mean. Like, I was about to come straight up for air, and if that little bit had got me killed, I'm a real upset. Was it? Is it creep vines? Yes, it is. Oh wait, I need a knife though, don't I? Wait, or do I just need to be? 
Um, barehanded. No, I, I do need... Shit, I need a knife. Let's see, salt deposit. I hope there's something equivalent... Ah, oh, fuck. Equivalent to... Um, reef backs. Oh, I do want to check that out too, that base. Hold on, like, pr let's prioritize the tank, though. I mean, that's obviously one of the most important things we got to do right now. Because we need to be able to breathe longer. Uh, quartz. Thank you. New things might pop up now. Uh, more quartz, okay. I guess I can't scan quartz. There's a lot of things here, too, so we'll grab that. Oxygen. By the way, this video today is sponsored by Bob K, because he donated it during the last stream, and I wouldn't have been able to get this if it were not for him, so thank you, Bob. Everyone thank Bob, please. Um, ooh, what is that? Is that, uh, is that limestone, or what is that? Oh, it's nothing. God damn it, game, you tricked me. This, like, distant, like, screeching is just unsettling, to say the least. All right, we need to see. <laughs> I'm getting distracted. We need to see how to uh, make the knife. Pretty sure I can see from here. Um, Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. So look, don't you need fucking... Oh. Okay, we need the creepine cluster. Oh, you're such a bane. <gasps> it's a bangling. He's out hunting. They're so fast. Jesus Christ. All right, back to finding creep vines. God damn it, Zach. If only you were just paying attention. If only you remembered everything about this game. If only it wasn't butter. Oh, I don't remember. Don't remember where it was though now. <laughs> uh, there's no like direction. Like there's no east or anything. Hopefully they add that soon. Because not having. What is that? Not having directions is, well, obnoxious. Titan hole fish. Man, you take a long time to scan. Hold on, hold on. Let me just get out here. Check you out. Titan hole fish. Wait, uh. A large docile herbivore which emits oxygen and is defended by the small aggressive symbiotes which accompany them. Slow, stupid, and delicious. Complex gills line the inside of the hole which drawing cold water in and emitting warm oxygen rich water in its place. Attract symbiotes which make the whole fish their home and fiercely ward off any approaching life form. Uh, ba 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 ba. Migrates more or less at random, feeding from nutrients deposited by the symbiotes. The tight peeper, get on my face. The titan hole fish has evolved entirely beyond basic survival mechanisms like speed, intelligence, or hunting. It exists in a semi-permanent state of unreflective calm, swimming forward on impulse, fully trusting the complex ecosystem which supports it. So it's a valuable oxygen source. What's the little things that defend it? Those? Oh, Jesus, pingling. Yeah, that's it's these things. Oh god! Oh Jesus! They're so they're so mean. I didn't do anything. God. I'm just scanning you guys. <laughs> I'm just such a curious gaming guy. Okay, here's creep vines. Now we just need to find clusters on them. There we are. <clears throat> I think we only needed one, but I'll grab a couple just in case. There's another grab trap. There's a lot of quartz over here. Near blueprint acquired. Acquired. Boom. <gasps> sea glide fragment. Yes. Oh shit, my inventory's full. 
There's so many quartz here. What is that? Probably salt. Oxygen. Yes, I know. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. <laughs> uh, where am I? Over there. Man, these penguins are no joke. Look at that thing going after that. Oh, and the penguin just did a drive-by. Shit, they're aggressive. I hope I don't get in their bad side. I hope they're always nice to me. Because those, like, that mouth is... That mouth is scary. Yeah. Oh, God, they take up so much room. Hold on, wait. Uh, I don't know how I'm drinking underwater, but... Fear me, mortals! <laughs> Oxygen. Yes. Yes, I'm aware. Thank you. What is that over there? Oh, it's just a pangling. I thought it was a giant fin. I was pretty spooked about that. You know, it's pretty convenient that they can just drop this like that. I wish I'd seen it actually come down. I missed the whole look up bit. Uh, oops. So we want to go here. Lubricant. Ugh. We want to make that. We want Signal to... Location uploaded to PDA. Robin, the boss wants a sit rep. I'm cold, I lost all my gear, and I'm no wiser to what's going on. But I'm alive. I can't authorize another drop. Hold on. There's an emergency cache. Hasn't been touched since the scouts landed six months ago. Could be useful. Send me the cords. On your HUD. Okay, so they do go bad. Shit. Um, let's, uh, dump this off. Probably don't need to hang on to any of this stuff either. I'll, you know. Uh, but we still, we do really need, hold on, this is going to bog, bog me, bug me. We do need to get some creep line and, um, make that, make that tank. Like I said, it's still... Still a priority. Okay, so currently I'm going in the direction of the door. Uh, I feel like this wasn't a good way to go. I was hoping to just. Okay, well, yeah, I'll get that. I'll get that in a second. We're still doing this. Okay, we got some creep vine. Can we? Well, I can't remember, but can we? Um. What am I saying? Put on multiple tanks. I don't think so. I know we can upgrade them. Fiber mesh. I need to go grab the titanium I so stupidly put away, or do I? No, I don't. Did I just make a beacon? Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I got that blueprint, but I was about to be real goddamn pissed <laughs> I just did that. Yeah, I don't... Okay, but how do we make the fins again? Because that could be useful. Pipe, floating air pump. Fins, two silicone rubber. Wait, we can do that. First of all, we have one right there. I think we just need to get that right. And then, yeah. Might as well. Just get a little bit of speed out of that. Uh, there we go. All right, cool. Let's put that away. We don't need that. We'll keep the water. We probably don't need to hang on to that, but. Actually, let's use the water. And drop that. Alright, now we're going. Uh, ran into something. Looks so cool underwater. There's a couple um, you know, flash effects that are going on, like a bug glitch or whatever, but that's fine. What do we? What is our oxygen at now? 75. I can't remember what it was at before. I think 45. Man, what if it said how to upgrade it? I'm going to be real upset. Should have checked that out first. I 
I'm just, I really want to see like new creatures too. Probably should be mining stuff as I go. What is that? Who's doing this? Who's pooping? Who's farting? Also, are you guiding me here to show me something spooky? Like why here specifically, you know? I'm at night, so, oh god, it's so scary. It's so dark. I might need to up the brightness in editing. Oh, hold on. Oh, that's so inconvenient. I mean, thanks, I guess, but how did you even get it under here? Oh, unless this is something someone else built, okay. And they're just like, hey, someone left that. Take it. Ooh. High capacity. Oh, yeah. Nice. What is doing that? Is it you? I I? Or is it just this? Oh, no, he's, he's eating them. It's blood. <laughs> uh, how do I get out? Well, let's just do this first. Wait, why is it still saying it? Is there more? Am I missing something? Let's go back. Oh, maybe it, it wants me to scan the foundation. No. Nothing else, right? Maybe it's just always going to be there. I don't know. I don't think I'm missing anything. Unless this is something. What's this? Precursor technology. Bounty? Gain rewards for precursor technology. Huh. Interesting. Well, let's just start heading back. God, this would be freezing. How are you even alive? I want to sea glide so bad. That's gonna like change everything. Well, sea moth would be even better, but you know, I'm trying to be a little realistic here. Or, or that hover bike thing that you saw in the trailer. Ooh, I'm curious. What was that? What is that? What are you? Hey. New creature discovered. Zach shouldn't be curious. Zach should leave. Which is so interesting. Uh, this way. Well, let's get some air first. Oh, I hope you guys are enjoying this. <laughs> I'm having a great time. Oh, just moss or something. Can I... No. I guess there's, I should probably start slashing stuff, seeing if I, I get anything out of it. Also, keep an eye out for uh, sea glider parts. Because I, I still haven't found that one that was close by. Um, I can't, are these ones? No. I thought that was like, for the acid or whatever. Nope, oh, yep. So I don't even know what kind of creatures are supposed to be in this. I know like one rumored one is the rock puncher. Um, Cause I saw a recommended thumbnail for that. And that was one that was supposed to be in the original game, but it ultimately got scrapped due to like a, I think it was like a conflict in uh, like the original game back when it was like an early access a long time ago, you could just like there's destructible environments. So you could like, t you know, pave the way on the ground and stuff. And that rock puncher creature kind of like interfered with that because they eventually took it out. Okay, let's see. Ooh, we need a lot of stuff. 
We need a lot of stuff. Beacon, what's in here? Computer chip, wiring kit. Okay, so I think the next order of business is to go for um, the higher tank. <sighs> I should probably stop the episode here. Okay, I am gonna act, in fact, end the episode here. I was very much debating just going in a straight line really far and seeing what we come across. But I'm going to do that next episode. I think this one was just getting into it again, you know, getting a little bit of a start. Um, but next time, like I said, we're going to prioritize getting the upgraded uh, tank so we have more air. And I want to, in some direction, just go straight as far as, like, I can until I hit, like, a void or something. I don't know. Maybe that would kind of suck without the sea glider because maybe, maybe I should be looking out for that first. Like, so that the tank and the sea glider are the two priorities um, in the next episode, but I still want to travel out farther and see if we can come across new creatures. I don't know how much they've added already. They might be holding off in some of the cooler ones until closer to release. I kind of hope that's the case. I kind of hope they leave in one Leviathan type creature. Um, but I do hope that they, they hold off in like 70% of the game or something for full relief, full release, because I want to feel like it's fresh again when that finally comes. Um, so I don't know if I'll be doing every update as it comes out and checking it out or something. I don't think so. Um, I'd rather like give long breaks and come back every now and then after a bunch of updates and check it out again or something like that. Or maybe we'll get everything we can out of this and then wait until the full game finally releases. You guys have to let me know uh, where you're leaning towards. But hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.